Hi, it's Ed Butowski. So today we got the GDP numbers for the fourth quarter of 2023, and they came in a lot faster and a lot stronger than what people had expected. Now, why does this matter to you? Because if in fact interest rates are going to come down, they would come down to stimulate a slow economy. If the economy is doing pretty well, interest rates might not drop as quickly. What does this matter to you again? It has to do with your credit card bills, mortgage rates, everything will remain higher if in fact the economy is growing at a faster rate because they don't want to drop interest rates to stimulate an already strong economy. So that's why this matters to you. Question is now, you hear a lot of discussion about a recession. A recession is two quarters in a row of negative GDP growth. We don't even have one quarter of negative GDP growth. So I do not believe we're going to be heading into a recession. I do believe 2024 is going to be a really strong year for the economy and for the stock market. And more importantly, interest rate sensitive investments like utilities are going to do very, very well because I do believe we're going to see interest rates drop. But this is why these wonky statistics matter to you. GDP growth is a huge a relevant factor in determining what kind of interest rates you're going to be paying on things that you purchase and loans that you have. So again, as boring as it sounds, GDP really does matter to you. Thanks.